but it didn't stick. One take. Non-stick spray. Both of these have soy lecithin. Now, that's a naturally occurring group of fats. You can find these in egg yolk. Propellant to dispense spray. ConAgra, company that owns Pam. Pam cooking spray uses a blend of food grade propellant, which includes butane and propane. Generally recognized as safe. Grass was a product of the Food Additives Amendment of 1958. From this moment on, we are going to have stringent tests to classify any food additive as grass. But along with this amendment, there were were 700 additives that were exempt from the new test. Propane and butane were on the list. PAM actually stands for product of Arthur Mayerhoff, founded PAM in 1959. The propane and butane should dissipate. Okay. Buckle up. Flame. Hmm. Bertoli olive oil has no propellants and additives in it. We should get the same result. You want to hear it, here it go. We pay a premium price to consume propane and butane. These two products were both on sale for $3.99. Regular price for Pam was 30 cents more. This is just nothing but making an informed buying decision. You can make your own nonstick spray and know what's in it. I got you. It's a one-to-one -one ratio, half cup vegetable, same amount of water. The spray bottle, test that out. And all my bakers have a half a cup vegetable oil, half a cup margarine or butter, half a cup flour. Thank me later. I used to go to school with this girl named Cooking Spray. We tried calling her Pam, 